Hello, Ziva Herd. Welcome back to Splatoon 3. Today, we are heading to the sixth site of the game, and this might be the last one. I'm really not sure if we take a look at, of course, the menu here and go to the map. Everything else, it brings us back to site one. So I can only imagine this might be the last um, area that we need to tackle before we finish the game. Is this one the farthest out? Sure feels like it. What was that in the water? I thought I saw something. Uh-oh. I'm sure we'll find out when we get there, for better or for worse. Whoa, huh, I see lots of sea, but there's hardly any land. I wonder how long it's been like this. Oh, hey, I'm getting a whole bunch of readings from the top of that weird building over there. That's gotta be Gramps. Come on, Agent 3, let's go. So yeah, this is the Happiness Research Lab. So we will do our best to explore everything in this area and hopefully we'll do pretty well. So. I already had this balloon hanging out here, so I probably don't want to go for that immediately, though. Let's take a look. So, there is a lot to tackle here. So it seems like we're on the top of buildings that have been sunken under the sea, which is pretty crazy. So let's fill up all of this as much as we can, as per usual. We're looking for one more uh, Sardinium to unlock our next sort of upgrade slot, so that'll be pretty cool. But I could try for this. I don't know if I'm gonna actually be able to get it. I'm guessing no, but you know, worth trying. Boom, get that one a little bit. Then we'd have to go way over there, so <laughs> I'll try it for it right now. Ready, gotcha. And then, oh uh, no, I don't think that's gonna reach. Uh, <laughs> yeah, not gonna reach. So we'll have to go back. But it's interesting how many little areas we could skip. Wait, how do I go back? Because this is just one way, isn't it? It is just one way. That's weird. Uh, Can I jump back over? Huh, I was not expecting that, so I guess I might just have to fall off. Why are the rails one way? That doesn't feel very useful. Okay, we're back here though. Back on your feet, yep. So let's actually explore this area a little bit. This is what I wanna do. We have over 10,000 power eggs right now, so we can get through a lot of this super duper easily. Oh, I guess there are some return rails, and we get our first golden record pretty quick. So that'll help add to the music a bit here, but more than that, we have some little side paths to check out, and we have our first level waiting for us too. This is going to be, bet bet you missed us, defeat the enemy sneaking around in the mist and reach the goal. Okay, in this mission, you must defeat your enemies and open the heavily secured goal with the hero gear. I wanna make sure we're filling up what we can. We're at level 95 right now, and I wanna to try to get to 100. That would be pretty cool, right? Defeat the enemy sneaking around in the mist and reach the goal. So last time we had this, it was actually fog. Wait, that's like the end right there, isn't it? Seems like it, but I don't think we can do anything with it just yet. Let's try getting up here. Anything fun waiting for me? Not really. All right. <laughs> well, I'm glad I checked either way. We can't get in in any way, so we'll have to just move forward with the level and try to find a way through. Uh. Oh, oh no, oh no, you know what? Boom, I'm gonna splash one of them pretty quick. But, yeah, I'll go for you. I think that was the only two around here, so that's pretty good to clear those out pretty quickly, because those can be tough enemies. Yeah, let's call you back. Let's see what's going on with this. We got ourselves some armor that I'm definitely going to make the most of. Oh no, but yeah, I'm sure the difficulty is really gonna start stepping up here soon enough. Whoa, there we go. Small fry helping out but I might wanna try some other stuff here. Like we have a spot bump. I missed it. Ooh, you had the octo roller there, so that was a little scary. Ah, wait, there's another one. Okay, that was pretty good, pretty good. Gotcha. So far, not too bad. We're clearing them out. I don't think I missed any boxes or anything, so yeah, let's keep it moving. Okay, gonna pop a lot of that stuff. And ooh, I might save that Trizuka for when we really need it here because we can deal with most of these guys just like that. Ooh, wait, there's two of them on top of me right now. Gotcha, and gotcha. That was a little scary. I lost my armor, but it's okay. So these enemies, if they do not mess around, they really wanna beat us up. Gonna grab that armor. And once we get up here, I might whip out the Trizuka. Ready, and ooh, I miss, I miss. Yeah, and I miss. Yeah, not really worth it. <laughs> Where did you go? There was somebody over here. Ooh, there's a bunch of people over here. Okay, come on. Oh no. Oh, they're behind me. Get out of here. That was ridiculous. I think that's it for right now, but ooh, we do get the, the rain cloud. Which I guess I'll move forward this way. Oh no. You know what? Yeah, now's a perfect time just to throw that out there. Don't you dare, don't you dare. 
and they're trying to jump away. Not on my watch. Wait, 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 gotcha. And there's one more hanging out somewhere. Where'd you go, where'd you go? I think you're right over here, right? I'm chasing you down. Oh no, no, no. We're fine, oh, there's two of them actually. Gotcha, and gotcha. There we go, awesome, and that's gonna leave the door open for us to complete this level. So the first mission, already pretty intense, with lots of enemies sneaking around that mist, but we got through it. Okay, so with that done, our first level of the day complete, and do we wanna go that way or this way? That's where things get a little bit confusing, but for right now, I'll just try to get up here and clear out whatever we can. If it's anything like the last couple of episodes, there have been tons of levels. So we get ourselves another lamp decoration. We've been getting a few of those too. But this way we can backtrack to where we were. And can break these open, no problem. Got it. And that's gonna be our first Sardinium of the day and one of the most important ones because it should allow us to unlock our new section of hero gear. So first off, spend our five Sardinium right there. And that'll be the better sensor automatically marks objects even in kid form. The scan reaches a bit further while submerged in ink. So we'll upgrade that for sure. We should have enough for this next one right down this way. Suit recovery up further increases the recovery rate of your suit after it's broken by enemy ink. So that'll be really, really useful. So we just have one more left to get, but unfortunately it is quite expensive. We'll need five more Sardinium. Will we be able to find all that in today's episode though? Will there really be that much Sardinium waiting around? Or maybe I've missed them. I really hope I haven't, but I guess we'll end up finding out one way or another. So it looks like we'll have a path over there. I'm a bit curious of, of over that way. It looks like there's another level we can find. Oh, so it looks like Callie might have some stuff for us too. So what's the best way back over to her? I guess just going back like this. Yeah, this is probably the way to go. But I'm very unlikely to do the levels in order. It's just, it's just hard too with this many different paths to go. But first off, let's talk to Callie and then we'll maybe try some levels over that way. Uh, hi, Callie. Uh, sorry, I splashed her. She doesn't want to talk to me. Uh, there you go. Guess what? I've got some extra power eggs for you, courtesy of the captain. They said, you're welcome. Well, there we go, 100 more points. So we're still over 10,000 here. And can I jump off from there? I don't know if I trust that. That didn't look like a jump I could make, but I might try again later. Uh, hmm, yeah, that was certainly odd. There is a lot of stuff and you found something. What was it? Right here, it is another locker decoration. Um, this time it looks like a little server kind of thing. Interesting, some kind of computer thing for sure. And we could try this level. You know what, yeah, let's go for it. This is going to be keep it rolling, reach the goal using a roller. Sounds pretty simple. Okay, come on, we gotta be able to do this one uh, with the splat roller. In this mission, you must use a roller to defeat your enemies and reach the goal. We honestly haven't been using the roller too much in this story mode, it just hasn't popped up too much, so this is a little bit refreshing, if you ask me. Okay, so let's go for it. Reach the goal using a roller. First splash you got already with the Octarians, yeah. This looks like a sweet spot to hold ZR down and just go to town with the roller. That's exactly what I'm doing. Just gotta be careful with that because sometimes you can round up ink pretty easily. Roller doesn't just roll, tap CR for a horizontal swing, um, or jump and press CR. So yeah, pretty good. Oh wait, gotcha. I might just suit up a little bit, throw out one of those, and then jump and boom, get you covered. They didn't even notice me. Hello, gotcha. We don't move too fast with the roller at first, we need to like build up some speed. I got th those two. I can at least get you a little bit, there we go. There's another chance to fling that ink. Whoa, somehow dodge those shots. Are you turning into a roller main? I, I don't think so, but I'll try my best. Okay, we're going, we're going. Ooh, that was good. Two for one, count it. Okay, ready? That's it, much better. And then slash you two. And that's gonna be some extra armor for us. I'm definitely going to make the most of that. We're gonna roll with that roller, <laughs> nice one. Come on, and a little bit more. Got it, that's gonna be 15 extra points for us, which is always nice. So I need to get rid of each of these Octarians. Not too bad. Now we gotta launch way up here and boom, gotcha. That was close, I wasn't expecting one to be hiding right there. Watch your footing here, Agent 3. Okay, this is looking a little tricky, but 
I think we'll be all right. Got it. Okay. This is where things can be a bit of a problem, but if I just fill up on ink really quickly, go over that way, I can maybe do something, but maybe this isn't the way to go about it. Because I could, yes, sneak to the side. Ooh, you found a way around. Whoa, hey! <laughs> that was scary. Ha, never let your guard down. Octarian, because <laughs> they're hairy, I get it. All right, so now that we're behind them, we can at least sneak, sneak up on a couple of them, get some good hits in. Oh no, wait, gotcha! But there's still more here. So uh, maybe I could do that. I don't know if that really worked too much. It sort of did. Problem is I get one of their attention. And the rest of them come running over, or at least facing towards me, but I can just, wait, gotcha. So that's all of them, sweet. Always nice to pick up some power eggs for your efforts. Yep, glad to grab those. The music here is so much fun, I love it. And one last balloon for the road. There it is, I'll roll this into there, and we are good. So we're rolling around with the roller, not too bad. Glad to pick up a classic weapon. So there we go. Ooh, tons of points. So we'll be able to immediately use those right there. And that's gonna cover a lot of ground. We'll even be able to climb up there really quickly. Just wanna make sure that getting our bases covered in the meantime. What's gonna be in this one then? It's gonna be our first sunken sea scroll of the day, number 21. Seems these are instructions on how to mummify an inkling. Maybe in olden times, inklings thought if they preserved their bodies after death, they could be revived someday? But that's, well, there's no way this is a real one stuck here, right? No, of course it isn't, right? Oh, that's creepy and scary. I don't like having it off this page. I don't wanna see that again. All right then, so one upgrade point for that, which is pretty nice. And with that, we can go over here. Look at that. So we figured it out. We could we could get over this way. We'll definitely, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> I have to cover this up. That was close. But oh, this is very glowy. I like that. Okay, so let's figure out what we can do around here. It looks like it's just gonna be this level. The enemy ink is lava. Reach the goal without touching enemy ink at all. Ooh, this one might be a bit of a challenge. In this mission, you must reach the goal with the time limit without, or within the time limit without touching any enemy ink. So I only have the the rollers to survive through this. Reach the goal without touching enemy ink at all. Whatever you do, don't touch the bad guy's ink. So let me charge up again, because that wasn't so good. You only get one curling bomb per area. Watch your aim. Uh, uh-oh. So do I just have to restart? I guess so, um, unless I can make a crazy jump, but I don't think that's gonna happen. So I wish they could have told me that maybe a moment sooner. <laughs> that would have been great. So let's run up and just do a quick tap. There we go, much better, much better. Okay, so refill our ink, and then can I make that jump? Do I wanna risk it? I don't think I do. There we go, so now just follow the path the bomb made and hope for the best. Come on, come on, come on, jump! <laughs> this is scary. Uh, careful, if you hold R during your charge, it'll get bigger, but it won't travel as far. So this way's more difficult, but we do get some uh, stuff out of it. Come on, come on. Yes! It's too bad you can't throw out a few more, huh? I know that'd make it way easier. Oh, that is so scary, but we did a great job with that one. And what about this? If you gotta cancel out of a curling bob, transform by hitting ZL, then let go of R. Okay, that's a good idea. Whoa. Oh, also, I can look up like that. Gotcha. So I think right there, yeah, that was good. That's that. Better get going. I'm trying. Gotta jump over that side. There we go. Never doubted you for a minute. Well, thank you very much. What's going on with this one? Ooh, a bunch of them. That's the end, but look at that mess. Okay, so grab that checkpoint at the least. That's good. Oh my. Uh, that twirling wall is annoying. I think what we're supposed to do here is bounce off of that. Oh, I think I did it. Maybe. Uh, sort of? Oh, I'm supposed to jump onto this wall. Whoa, that was so close. That was awesome though. Okay, for this one, we do technically have multiple tries. I need to go across there, then I, over that way. I uh, really gotta throw, time to throw here, huh? So I think, 
It seems simple, but it's not really. I think I need to go this way first. Yeah, that's definitely the move there. And then from here, I think we just throw it straight like that. I think that was a good move. I'm trying to be really careful and making really specific decisions. So do I backtrack? I think I might want to backtrack. So I'm trying to get a good look at what exactly I'm trying to get to, you know? And I think that this is the way. So if I toss that over, oh no, oh no. Ooh, this is where things get risky. I need to do that and then jump over. Whoa, that was a move. That was crazy. How did I even do that? I like turned and then did like, yeah, like cool jump. I didn't even know you could do that. That was awesome. Oh, and we get a little refill right there. Come on, this is the final checkpoint. Can we use this moving thingy somehow? I would sure hope so. And this one I might have to, oh no, oh no. Oh, now I'm in trouble. Maybe I should, <laughs> mission failed, he touched the enemy zinc. How do we do this one? This might be one, yeah, with my last life here. Maybe it's not worth risking. I think we're gonna go this way instead. So I do not wanna redo the whole thing. Oh, that actually went over it? Okay, good to know. Got it, and I'm just gonna jump, jump. Ow, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, there's the end, that was so close. Almost there, you got this. I don't know if that was a good idea. Oh no, ooh, wait a minute, jump for it. Okay, not bad actually. Come on, this is our only chance with this one. Oh no, I don't know if that was good or not. We're gonna find out. Get it, whoa, no way, no way. Ah, oh, now I'll have to do the whole thing over. That really stinks. Oh, actually, I don't have to do the whole thing over. I thought I did, Never mind. Uh. I'm just here, okay, I'll take it. Gotta land on this thing, even though this is a bit different from last time. I wonder if I could just, ah, it's not worth it, it's not worth the risk. We're just gonna go. See, so yeah, I, I really did think that that was it, but I can do that and just go straight across. That one was super simple. But if I do wanna time this correctly, what I gotta do is jump, and then I think I can make that just barely in time. We're gonna try that one. Ooh. Okay. Let's see what we can do with this. Got it. Jumping across. Now this is the jump that's a bit scary. Ah, yeah, not quite. That's a shame. I don't know how to do that one exactly, but you don't get much room for error now, do you? Okay, so we're going. No, no, no. I know about that. We're going this way again. I need to jump onto this thing. And then I might want to just jump across from over there. So, ready. Got it, and we're good. So doing, no wait, that's not what I wanted. Oh no, oh no, come on. Ooh, okay, that was at least a little bit better. I don't know if it was enough though. It is so tough, but I think I could, no, and I, ah, oh, that is so frustrating. Just, it's hard to do that kind of specific movement. Ooh, I made it, I made it, I can't believe that jump. Wow, that was ridiculous. But we made it to the end, and now I can end the level. That was amazing, not bad. All right, that definitely took me a good couple of tries, but there we go, we got through it. So with that done, I think we definitely need to double back and explore some of the other levels, but 1900 for all that trouble. Is there anything else left to find in this area? Doesn't look like it. So yeah, we can leave this one in the dust and try out some of the other spots. So up on top of that building is where I think we'll find our next level that we've yet to complete. And it doesn't look like there's anything more here. So yeah, let's go for all of this. Where we have, oh, there's actually no level on this one. Okay, over there there's a level and up here. So let's try this one out. I was trying to do things at like a little sections of a time, but that could be a little bit challenging. Uh, 1200 for that is no problem. I'm all uh, small fries working on that. I'm just trying to fill everything else out a little bit. It doesn't look like there's too much here for us though. So let's try breaking this open, and this is going to be Torture Tour. Fight your way to the goal. This one sounds scary. 
So what kind of level is called Torture Tour? In this mission, you'll be greeted by various and sundry types of enemies. Prepare accordingly. So we'll keep with the hero gear for now, but geez, I am definitely a bit worried about this one. Okay, so fire your way to the goal. Okay, it is way too quiet in here. Be ready for anything. I'm waiting for it. I already see some enemies poke around the corner. There they are. Okay, uh, and somebody's over here. Wow, they are all over the place. So I just need to move it, I think, for the time being. Got it? That can't be it, right? I think there's gonna be another one on this side. Or maybe that's just a crate with stuff in it. Yep, okay, we're good, Never mind. Oh, here you are, here you are. Try to sneak up on me. Try to sneak up on you. There's one camping out above you. Climb down and fight fair, you coward. Okay, oh, not the bouncers. Okay, I think with this, we might just have to, yeah, throw out a distraction like that, get you a little bit, and then we gotta move. Whoa, got it. They are still moving towards a little small fry friends, so there we go, much better. Jeez. And that'll be a key for us, which we use to open up something. Key nabbed, where do we use that? Let's go back and take a look. Oh, right over here, I didn't even see all this, so open that up and we will get, oh no. Uh, how about, I can see that something's ahead, right? Let's see that. Whoa, it's that I'm flying. Let's do another one, because I know that they're over there. Boom, okay, that got at least a couple of them. Very cool, very cool. And there's more coming in. That was good. Awesome, so what was that? The ultra stamp, time to fly in and splat in them. All right then. What's down this way? Oh, I thought I just fell on my doom for a second. So I don't know when to use that. I might save it for when things are looking really scary. But I don't think we've used that one yet. Oh no, cool. That could have been better. Gotcha. All right, so. Ooh, that still got me, darn. Thought I backed up enough, but not really. Time to jump over to this side. Lots of uh, power eggs to get at the least, so that's good. Very plentiful level. Okay, do I want to use this or now? Whoa, I just threw it. A trizuka? Now we're talking. So you know what, yeah, let's let's use these while we get the chance to because it seems like our chance might leave pretty quickly. Um, no, wait. I think I need to get up here. Splat you and your friend right down there. Oh no, but right away there's this more coming straight for us. <laughs> but this one's locked off again. And the gold must be hiding behind this vault. But we don't have the key, ugh. Okay, gotta move, gotta move, gotta move. Oh, not good. I think I wanna just hop up here, sneak up on you, and then maybe just super slam? That's not gonna reach, unfortunate. It's fine. But I think that'll have the key for us. So now we're gonna go back. You got the key, phew. I didn't realize I was holding my breath. Can you get out of here now? I'll try my best. So obviously somebody's waiting for me, but I think we can splat them before they can splat us. What about the rest of them now? Whoa. All right then, so maybe not too much torture there. We were able to survive it, but geez, that was definitely tough. All right, so torture tour is completed. And a lot of points for us there too. So is there anything more around this platform that we need to grab? It doesn't look like it. So I guess we can only really do one thing and that is to take this ink rail all the way up to the big building. There's a lot to cover up around here. There is going to be somewhere, there it is, uh, another golden uh, record. I'll pick up the music a bit more. And what about up this way? Oh, it's sort of playing, whoa, here we go. Nice, we get ourselves a, I forget what that's called, but yeah, just sort of an archway. There's a specific name for it, I think. So we're finding lots of cool stuff here. We have sort of hotel music playing, it feels like. Gonna toss that over like that. And that's gonna be another pathway out that way. Uh, we'll do that soon enough, because that is another level to tackle. But for now, if there's one waiting for us, we might as well try this. Octarian Heights, climb the enemy-filled tower to reach the goal. Let's get started. Okay, so what's next? In this mission, you must break through your enemy's defenses and reach the goal. So defeating more Octarian enemies doesn't seem like too big of a deal to me. I think we can handle it. On the enemy filled tower to reach the goal. Lots of enemy just blasting. Oh, 
Oh, I see how this works. I think we're just gonna be combined, confined to like one room. Oh gosh, I can't really reach them very easily. It doesn't, yeah, go out that far. Uh, but, oh, we're going down? Uh-oh, I can't quite reach you. There's a wall in between us right now. Huh. I guess I'm just waiting. That's all I have to survive to make it through this level, huh? Okay, uh, doors open. Looks like we have to, we have a surprise waiting. Oh man. Let's go with one of those and hide back a little bit if I can. Oh no, no, no. The goal is above you. You just have to climb this nightmare tower of death somehow. Well, let's try to make it around the perimeter first where there's enemies all over waiting. Yes, looks like there's an entryway from behind. Whoa, and they are just popping up all over the place. It's crazy. Ah, oh, that didn't quite get him. That's unfortunate. But I do see you up here, come on. That's a great chance to get you, so glad we took it. And I guess we're good to head up here. Wait. Oh no. That was both of them pretty well too. I'm actually gonna switch back to little buddy and see if we can't cause a distraction that way. Seems like it worked. Oh no. Little buddy, uh, I'm gonna toss you up there if I can. That didn't really work the way I wanted it to. Wait, gotcha? And then these two, maybe. I got one of them. I'm gonna call my little buddy back. I could go up that way or I could plop back down to finish you off. There we go. I wanna try to make sure we get every single one of them. So back up here now. I haven't seen any more enemies, but I'm sure they're popping up soon. Anyone else picking up some real sinister vibes here? Okay, so we do have uh, the triple ink strike. Yeah, something rough is coming up. You can throw the three strikes, make them count. Okay, whoa. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do, but uh, I guess that's what we're doing. Oh man, can I throw one more? There we go. It sort of worked. Oh wait, no, it didn't work. That didn't even count. Okay, so I don't think I can reach them anymore. <laughs> That's sort of a shame. I'll try. Come on, come on. Oh, that, that reach. It got one of them. There's another. And another, come on. Gotcha. I didn't get this one though. Oh, come on, that was silly. Why can't I get you? I'm not letting you survive this one. How? What are you talking about? Why is the game so ridiculous all of a sudden? Come on, that's gotta reach you. All right, one more time, and if not, we're leaving, because this is just silly. There we go, finally. Jeez, that was ridiculous. All right, we're out of here, see ya. Sorry, can I do the normal way? I just fell over and just didn't give me enough time. Okay. Okay, so Octarian Heights is completed, and it looks like next up is the boss fight, but we're not gonna be doing that now, of course. We'll be, we'll be saving that for later. Hey, do you have a favorite Squid Sisters track? I can't choose just one. They're also great, so yeah, we need to find some other ways around, like down this way. Oh, and there's a lot to clear out from around here. So yeah, plenty left for today's episode. Let's check out what this is. It's gonna be another Sardinium. We still need quite a few more though. And I think defeating the boss will give us a couple too. So let's try this out. This is Mission Fly Fishing. Fly with the inkjet, inkjet to reach the goal. Okay, so in this mission, you'll use the inkjet to overcome various challenges and reach the goal. Sounds like a plan to me. So we're just using the inkjet for now. Okay, so fire at will. There we go, ooh, got rid of you. So this is our first time using the inkjet in Splatoon 3 as well. Lots of firsts, right? So, go. Oh, I guess it just goes on forever, which is pretty cool too. Oh yeah, that's right, I need to go over these and they'll burst this up a little bit. So I guess I was supposed to use a crate in a different way. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, oh, I got up, I got up. Very cool, so now I can grab that and get the checkpoint. Remember, you can press B to get a little extra lift. I tried, it didn't work. So maybe I should. That didn't work either. That's sort of weird, right? Uh, I'm, just, I'm just gonna try to go straight across. Okay, that just barely worked. My gosh. Okay then. Uh, you can swim with CL. You won't lose your ink jet. Okay, you're going to have to figure out a way to get past those ink sticks. Agent one, agent three basically has a jetpack. I think they can do it. I sure hope so. Uh, 
See, I can boost across that one a little bit, but then I need to swim under this and then boost over that. Oh, just barely. Oh, just barely. I knew you could do it. Thank you. Awesome. So what's going on around here? Because I don't have any lives left. Uh, I see some platforms blows. Don't look down, or maybe do. Might be helpful. Gotcha. So I definitely want to do a little boost before every every jump between platforms. Because if not, things get quite scary. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Come on, come on. Oh man, we almost didn't make it. So yeah, extend that out. Oh no. Ooh, I just barely, just barely made that. That was scary. But what's going on now? Deep breath, you got this. I sure hope so. Ooh, send them all flying. Yeah, this has some nice big explosive shots, so you'd think we'd be able to handle this pretty well. Oh no. Come on, one more. These guys wiggle around so much, it's so hard to hit them. There we go. Now the bouncers. Come on. Trying to like time when they bounce, but it's hard. The the shot speed is still something to get used to. That's all of them. Look for a launch pad. Well, I do see it right over there. Once again, I'm trying my best not to get taken out here, because if so, we'll have to do the whole level over. But there's still so much more. Final checkpoint. Auto snipers ahead. Be careful. And I guess we won't have to do the whole thing over. Oh no. Uh, I don't think I can reach them with my attacks just yet, so we're just gonna move. Uh, ooh, so if I hit that, somehow I didn't. That's gonna hit it. Oh, we got it, okay. And it's all fallen. There we go, we did it. So I'll blast out real quickly, and then we are good to go. Let's get out of this one. Jeez, that was crazy. But yeah, lots of fun with the ink chat. So fly fishing is finished with another 1600. We're gonna have so many power eggs. I don't know what we're doing with all these to be honest with you, but there was some extra stuff down that way. I don't know if we should hop down and do that now. Cause I guess I could have done it before. Whoa, this was a mistake. <laughs> that was most definitely a mistake. I wonder if, can I take fall damage just by falling around there? I'm not really sure. Oh no, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to hop down the other way. I got a little turned around. <laughs> This isn't very productive, is that what I was trying to do? Luckily, we don't lose any points for falling around here. Uh, I don't know if I can make that jump either. Ooh, come on! I don't think we're supposed to get down that way, so we'll, we'll try to find some other way around for that one. Uh, and I could just jump over, right? Where am I? I'm right here, can jump to this thing. Jump, because we've already done this level. Is there anything more I need to find on this? There's not, so at this point, if I can, Bust those open and find something that way. That's exactly what we're looking for. Okay, there's gotta be something chilling around here. Hmm. I do see that. Ooh, be sure to pick that up. Ooh, look at this, it's another uh, sunken sea scroll. This is number 22. After leaping from Ingopolis Square to the world stage, Off The Hook has found their new side project, performing vocals for a rising rock band um, as Damp Socks featuring Off The Hook. Discovered online, their super talented collaborators offer an upbeat mel melancholy sound that had OTH hooked. That is so cool. I'm glad to see, you know, we get to see what Off The Hook is doing because they're my favorite out of the three different sort of, uh, I guess, idol groups. And hopefully we see them at some point in this story mode, but I don't know, at this point I have a feeling they won't show up. So maybe for a DLC or something. Either way, looks like we're going off this way. There is a level to complete here, so we could focus on that one for now, but I definitely want to, ooh, find what I can. This is gonna be some more uh, table turf battle guards, which we'll do eventually for sure. But for right now, I'm gonna bust that open for 1200 power eggs. And that's gonna be another piece of sardinium. Glad to have that one. Okay, so let's see what this level's gonna be all about. This is dive and dash, reach the goal within the time limit. Okay, so dive and dash, in this mission, you must reach the goal within the time limit using the Aerospray MG Burst Bomb. Ooh, the Aerospray is one of my favorite weapons ever. Look at that turf coverage, so good. Let's see how this goes. Reach the goal within the time limit, so let's start moving. Ready for this, pressure's on, Agent 3. Okay, whoa, this is gonna be like a little, whoa, the timer's activated, go, go, go. 
So for right now, I guess our goal is just to swim. Well, yeah, okay, this seems to be pretty doable so far. I gotta jump, and then, whoa! I gotta splat that for some reason. Oh, that's making a huge chain effect. We have 10 seconds remaining. Really? Whoa, I got a checkpoint. That's gonna add extra time. Gotcha. So far, I haven't actually needed to use the weapon so far. I guess I could get yeah, jump up like that for little shortcuts. Okay, this is where we could, yes, yeah, squid surge, whoa! <laughs> that was awesome. Nice catch, thank you. All right then, so I'm gonna go up here. Couple more seconds left, but I think we can make it because we get another checkpoint. Oh no, See, this is where we really gotta move. Oh, don't get left behind. I'm trying not to. These things move quick. Kinda cut those corners. I can climb up here. I don't know if it's worth squid surging for that one, but we can start spraying these two as well. Catch up, go, go, go. Ooh, oh, okay, I could have gone the other way for something. What was that? Just an extra couple of orbs. Okay, not too big of a deal. Well, I wonder, I could shortcut it. What's going on here? The whole thing is tilting. Whoa, come on, we got it. That was great, some extra time is added. Octo missiles incoming. That's gonna be a problem, but I think we can dodge them pretty easily. Just like that. Yeah, we got it. Oh, I missed an, uh, an egg. That's okay. Okay, I might want to try something like that, but even better is that. Let's see, get ready for a squid roll. Whoa, wait a minute, no! Ah, oh, that stinks. I guess I just didn't hit that at the right angle. That's okay, we're, we're not starting too far back. The Octa missiles are incoming again. Oh, okay, that didn't work out. That didn't work out at all. This part certainly is difficult. Come on, I just gotta recover. There we go. Okay, I learned my lesson from last time now. Gotta jump over this, splat that thing, you're gonna explode. I gotta hit both of these boost pads, and I jumped, I swear that I did, it just didn't quite work. It's okay though, because that is still the end of the level. What a fun little race that was. I really like the short racing ones, they're, they're pretty fun. All right, so we're back. Finished the dive and dash, and I think we're good to move forward. I'll double check the map. And it looks like there is something around, but I think that's on the upper part. So I think for now, we're good to ride over this way where I already see a couple of things that we can grab, like this little right here. This is gonna be another locker decoration, a little uh, turntable, right? A record player, something like that. And I'll definitely start that one up, but it's gonna bring us way up there. I don't know if I've been over there, actually. So. We'll have to take a look around. Now what's the deal with all of this? Cause there's quite a lot to sort of figure out. That one only costs a thousand, which with what we have right now is no problem. There is so much ground to cover here. I've noticed though that our thing isn't going up anymore. I guess 99 really is the maximum. Oh, this guy. Yeah, there's what we're trying to get to, inevitably. But even though I keep shooting stuff up, it, it's not really getting me anything. So I think that we've actually, more or less, Reach the end of it. Can I get that? Okay, he's just chilling out, up, up, out there. I don't think I can. Yeah, I don't know how we get to that one, but not through here, that's for sure. Either way, we have a level ready and waiting for us. This is conserve ink splat sustainably. Reach the goal before running out of ink. This mission will test your resourcefulness. You must use the limited amount of ink to reach the goal. We have splash matic it's probably not a good idea to do this, but now I'm doing it out of habit. So unless I absolutely have to. Let's see, careful, if you run out of ink, that's it, no refills. So I'll try to splat some enemies like that and then just try to maybe avoid them. If I don't need to fight, I should probably avoid fighting. Oh man, this whole area is very stressful. So this might be, ah, more about being stealth here. If I could hop up here, there we go. Ooh, that was some good moves actually, because we got through a lot of that without actually having to fight very much. Oh no, 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 wait, 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 ow. That's a problem. Okay, they don't seem to notice me. I don't know if that's worth it, but I'm, I'm so greedy. Uh, wait, 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 oh no. I might have to get rid of you. Only one quarter tank left. This is tough. I definitely need to wait here and sort of, uh, Get a bit of a, yeah, recovery. Uh, how come we're not there yet? Okay, come on, go, 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 go. Got it, got it. I mean, I can walk through this stuff and not take damage, right? I guess. It's pretty wild up ahead. Okay, just keep running. 
I think if we just keep running forward, yeah, they can't really get us. Yeah, we're fine. Oh no, this is where it gets wild for sure. Uh, okay, so I was able to sort of fool them there. Oh no, this is where things get risky. Okay, okay, I'm fine, I'm fine, I think. Because this inkbrush actually paints things to our color, which is great. Come on, come on, come on, no, 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 no. Wait, 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 just gotta keep running, gotta keep running. Okay, you're gonna fire at me from over there. Oh no. Now you, I might have to be a bit more careful of. Okay, these guys are just gonna fire right at me. <laughs> there we go. No, that's not worth it, that's not worth it. Come on, keep it going, keep it going. I'm so low on ink here and I need to just be really careful. If I could just run through the whole thing, they are all on top of me and everything. Where do I go from here? Oh, up this way, this way, this way, this way. Ready, jump for it! That was wild. Now you just gotta get to the end. I'm almost there, keep it the pace. We'll be out of here in no time. There it is. The captain's all like, that was pretty good, but you, there's still no, you're still no me. Okay, do I have enough to get through this? Luckily I do. Wow, imagine if I didn't. That would've been rough. Okay, so for a first time bonus, we get 1,900. Well worth it. Okay, so with that one done, tons of rewards. What else do we wanna do around here? I think, yeah, for this side, there's not too much. We just need to find a way onto that thing, which I don't see a way onto it at all. So I can't ink anything over here to the side of it. There's no platform on the side of the wall or something. I think this might just be, oh, over there. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, maybe I've overcomplicated this. We can hop onto, no, no, no. Why? Why? I tried to jump out. The game literally would not let me. Okay, trying again. Hop it on the, was that the wrong one? That might've been the wrong one. All I want is this one. There we go. Okay, so with all of this, I can break this level open. We'll hop into that in just a moment. Just wanna make extra sure, is there anything? Doesn't look like it. So yeah, we're good. Let's try out this level. That sinking feeling reached the goal quickly. Okay, here we go. In this mission, you must reach the goal at the top. sploosh Burst Bomb is our combo. I gotta stop doing this, it doesn't give me any extra points. And we only have one life for this one, so. Whoa, that's a lot. So it looks like you're gonna have to go all the way around, then climb up to the top. Well, at least you won't get lost. Well, I like the, the cues moving around, that looks so awesome. Okay, so this one's pretty to the point. We'll get some armor. Whoa, now oh, the floor is sinking. Wait, why is the floor sinking? I know, right? Okay, so let's get up quick then. And this is why it said we needed to be fast about everything. It's uh, still sinking. We gotta be quick. Got it. Jeez, I'm trying to be as fast as I can here, but it is really fast with the sinking. Okay, wait a minute. Yeah, grab that stuff and then go. Ooh. I might toss something like that over. There we go. Maybe that's a better move. Gotcha. Okay. And some extra armor that I don't know if we need too much. Whoa, things are sliding too? That was crazy. And I might be able to make this jump. That was pretty good actually. Oh no, oh no, oh no, I'm gonna have to leave that one. Sorry. Ooh, come on, just get up. No, 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 get up, get up, get up. The whole place is falling apart right now. I just gotta go. Uh, I can see the top, that's good. I can't. Almost there. Oh, okay, come on, no, 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 wait, boom, got it. Oh my gosh, that was one of the most intense missions so far, yikes. All right, so we're back, that sinking feeling, it really felt like sinking. So with that, I, yeah, we, we can hop onto this thing, ride this rail over, and get rid of this huge glob of it. Ready, right there. And what do we got? Just a pretty simple sunken sea scroll. Ooh, number 23. Operation Little Judd's Judgy Judgment. Praise behavior. Analyzing praise for quality. No imperfections found. I guess I'll just go after the toe beans. I don't know who's writing this one, but interesting. Okay, so yeah, with that done, it looks like that's everything for this area cleared out. We can head back over there and try to find what other, whatever other levels still need to be completed which I guess this way is a way to go. 
I think on the other side of that building there was some other stuff too. But there's a level ready and waiting for us. We might as well try it out. I think this will be another golden record, our last one of the area. So yeah, pretty good stuff there. I'm gonna fill that up. And I don't think there'll be anything extra on this, will there? No, wait, it's saying that there is, so gotta keep looking around just in case. But I think that for the most part, we're just focused on tackling this level. This is don't tease with the keys, find the keys and then lock the path to the goal. In this mission, you must reclaim keys from the enemy forces to unlock and reach the goal. Okay then, so yeah, I guess with this, uh, we'll just do the splatter shot ink mine. Let's give it a try. Oh man, find the keys and unlock a path to the goal. Gah, boxes! Whoa, whoa, those guys are moving. I remember these enemies. It's been a while. Okay, you know what would be perfect right now? Ink mines, which I have. Um, stick them in the tentacook's path, I guess. So these guys sort of roll around real fast. I already put one down, so hopefully that'll catch them. I guess for right now we just have to chase them down now. There's no way to catch them normally, as you can see. They'll just sort of explode us. Oh, that got them, but not enough. So I guess we'll have to put down a couple more. All right, that'll make a bit of a difference, but as you can see, they sort of recovered. Oh no. There's one, and that got them that, that time. Awesome. Very cool. <laughs> There's some extra power eggs just sitting in the tree. Did they grow off trees? I guess so. And what's up here? Ah, uh, soak in that view. There's actually quite a lot to do around here, isn't there? I think that's where we're headed. There's a bunch of vaults up there. I'm gonna assume that's what the keys are for. So we have one key so far. Many more left to get. But I do see you. So what if I were to, oh no, that's not what I wanted. So I can't get anywhere close to them without them going really fast, really far. I'm gonna put one right there, but they're gonna go the other way. So I don't know if that's, oh, that got them a little bit, but not enough. So you really need to put two in their path. Okay, so I know obviously they wanna wrap back around here. So if I do that, refill, and then put another one down, then I can just chase them all the way around. Or did that get them? I think it did. No, maybe not. Or maybe I can only put down two at a time so that other one exploded. That might have been what it was. As they're wrapping around again, this one's a little exhausting to catch up, but hey, in the meantime, I did miss another power egg. Take that, okay, we got them, that's good. See, it really requires two of them, so we need to scope out exactly where they are and where they're gonna be headed. And another. Is there anything up here for me? Not at the moment. You can see where they are heading off to with this one, right? It looks like both of them wanna go up here, I think? I'm trying not to set them off. And then, okay, let's think again, maybe here, and then, don't go that way, because I'm actually gonna send you the other direction. And one of them's gonna go, no, oh, you can't both go to the right. No, 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 wait, hold on. That's not what I want at all. I wanna chase them back this way. That's it, that's it, come on. Run, you two, run, run, run. Oh, I actually spotted them a little bit there, and they're still running. Come on, yes! Oh, that was a juicy one, that's exactly what I was looking for. So that's both of them taken down. Will that be two keys? It won't be, it'll be some uh, power eggs and a key. But that's three of them. Pretty sweet key collection you got there. Well, thank you very much. So, I think if we were to break up some of that stuff. They're running away, which I guess I'll put something there, and then maybe here, and then follow them the long way around. Oh, is there more than one of them again? Oh, I got you anyways. Wow, that'll be the last of them. Well, there was still one more. I gotta fill up an ink, though. Put that all the way up. Okay, so where did this last one go? I don't know. Somehow they're over here now. Whoa, wait a minute. Oh, I was almost there. Got him. Okay, and that's that. Their history. I think that's all of them. Very cool. So some of them we were able to spot without the, the mine, which is pretty nice. I wanna head up here for now. Oh man. And we're just gonna bust through all these walls. So I can use this key. And this key. Got it. This key, we have one more. This one will have a big chunk of them. Just climb, just a quick climb and we're golden. There we go. So, the shoes untied, ha, <laughs> kidding. <laughs> All right, well, they're being very silly. Uh, but we completed yet another level here in Site 6.
So don't tease with the keys is completed. And what else can we do in this area? It looks like there's something ready and waiting for us. Oh yeah, here we go, you found it. It is another food ticket. Cool. Now what's the deal with everything up here? Gotta be something with all this. 900 more points is no problem. Ooh, okay, so there actually is another level waiting for us up here. Wasn't expecting that, okay. So before we do, yeah, that looks pretty obvious. It's another locker decoration. This time it is a little umbrella. So let's finish filling this out and check out this level. This one is going to be enter the stamp gauntlet, smash all enemies within the time limit. Ooh, so we finally get to use the stamp thing a bit more. In this mission, you must defeat all the enemies within the time limit using, of course, the Ultra Stamp. So, let's try this out. Whoa. Okay, how do I do it? Just press the R to stamp. It holds the R for a rapid, st rapid stamp smashing. This is so cool, whoa! Okay, and then you can just hold it too. But we really wanna go crazy with it. That is wild! Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna stamp over here. And, Maybe a big one, did that not work? What do I do? Oh, maybe I just, oh, if the enemy is far away, hit with R. Whoa, okay. So let's get back to stamping. And get that checkpoint, I'm going down. Oh man, the countdown will start as soon as you spot one of the bowling ball bozos. So I just gotta keep going, keep going. This is going pretty well. The turns are a bit wide though, so we gotta factor that in. I think we got it. Okay, come, come on. Yep, I can throw some with R. Do the same thing over that way. That is wild that we could just throw it like that. I'm going back to this. Oh my. Um, let's do that. Because those turns can be so tough. We still need to get 12 more of them. So I could just right there. Oh, the triple. Pretty good, pretty good. Oh no. Oh, they got me pretty good there. I guess I need to smack you. I have 15 seconds remaining to get four more of them. That shouldn't be a problem. Come on, come on. You and one remaining, where are they? Uh, Way up there? Got it, whoa, that was cool. All right, mission complete, a fast one, but we got a little bit more experience with the stamp. So with another quick level in the books, I do see the balloon flying over. I wonder where's the best way to get that. It might be actually, Riding across and getting it just like that. Okay, that was super smooth. Now we're back up here, and that has me curious on what more we can do. Um, I think that down this way, yeah, straight down. I might just make a super jump. Yep, <laughs> awesome. We can spend a thousand points just like that, clearing this area out and getting to another level down here too. So, before we go too crazy, I just wanna make sure this is all covered. Then we can go back and make sure that this level is taken care of as well. So. We gotta be getting close to all the levels done, but here's one more remaining for us. This is going to be breathe in, breathe out. Time your movements carefully to reach the goal. So, in this mission, you must navigate unsteady footing to reach the goal at the top using the sloshing machine burst bomb. We'll get 2,000 as a reward. Which sounds pretty nice when we're closing in on 20,000 in total. I see the goal up there, but the path to it is moving. Well, good luck. Oh my. Uh, yeah, I could see this one being a bit of a problem, right? Can't quite reach them from there. Oh, I, I should've taken my chance. That's okay, we'll wait it out a little bit. So, these platforms sort of move in and out. Okay, I can get that. Whoa. And then I think from here, we need to hop down and across. Let's see all these guys. Come on. Oh, I got a bunch of them there. That was great. Wait it out a little bit, but then I gotta move. And then try to get you a little bit. One more, that'll do it. You made it look easy, thank you. All right then, so I need to get that. That's a little reward for getting rid of all the enemies, I suppose. Okay, so far so good. There are more enemies spawning in, so our work isn't over just yet. We see them over there, which we can actually hit them over the wall, which is pretty cool. Can I make this jump? Yes, I can. That was maybe not worth the risk, but it looks like I need to get over here if I am to beat you up. Well, actually, even then it's a little difficult because they got the shield. Oh, they don't see me. That was very fortunate then. Okay, whoa, whoa. that new way looks climbable. 
Indeed it is. And once again, we get little rewards for uh, clearing out all the enemies. Oh, this guy's already staring at me. They're ready. Okay, get rid of you first, I think. Come on. I think this can reach, just barely. And then you got it. Now that was fresh. Okay. And that's the way up, I agree. But first off, hold on. We got this waiting for us? No way. Oh, I thought I was gonna fall to my doom there. That would have been a problem. We're fine though. A little bump in the road, sure, but at least it's not a uh, total loss. There we go. So where was that? Okay, don't do not do the same thing again, but just gotta jump across, grab that, and now we can go up and finish this level, I think. There might be more, though. Gotta hop onto this platform. No, I think, yeah, that's the end of it. Okay, that wasn't too bad. That was fun, I agree. Very cool level. So we are churning through these pretty quick considering how many there are. So breathe in and breathe out is completed and take a deep breath after that one, right? So let's take a quick look at our kettles. Are we missing any? Six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So far, so good. I think we've actually completed all the levels. So if we wanted to, we could run through a little bit more just to make sure we get all the collectibles and then we can move on to the boss fight. I think I was supposed to be able to jump on that. That didn't work. Uh, try that again. Because the balloon that we had was way back there and that might be the final sunken sea scroll. So that's pretty exciting, right? Beyond that, I'm not sure what other collectibles might be waiting for us, so I'll have to go and check it out, but for right now, I just gotta go all the way back to the beginning of the area. I can't believe we're coming up to the end of the story mode already, though. It feels like it's gone by so fast. But also, it hasn't. Like, it, it's been a lot of levels. It's been super fun and engaging, but at the same time, I guess just because I've been playing it all in one go. Okay, so we gotta jump across like this. Got it. And then, there we go. They're pretty far spread, spread apart for this one. Gotta get to this ink rail. That was pretty good. Got it. All right, I'm ready for this one. <laughs> it's a small fry, I can't get them too, that's nice. Got it. Because remember, usually with these, you need to go all the way around. So I think we've just reached the halfway point. And it's so good that we've cleared everything out first because this would have been so much work if not. Okay, ready and splatting it. I think I'll be able to reach this one. There it is. Come on, just a few more left now. Gotta, oh gosh, whoa. I was almost too late for that one. That would have been a huge problem. Would have had to do the whole thing over. Come on, here's our last one. There we go. And what might be our final sunken sea scroll, number 24. Subject named Marigold. Nishio Oranda, alias. Anarchy District 33 blank. Poison Rouge. Alias, Rue du Blank Blank 196. I don't know what that means. There's like different names and aliases for these characters, which I think these are new characters that are found around the uh, Splatsville. So that's really neat. So maybe there's some secret history behind them too. Gotcha, so a little bit more of a mystery. Anyways, yeah, things are looking really good here, but there is still more to find. I need to jump over to this area. I think that's gonna be at the very tippity top of it though, so. I'll try to find my way around a bit more. So yeah, it looks like I need to go up this way. And then from here, I can jump over. And I hope I can get up there. It's a little hard to see from here, but I think this is where we can find some secrets, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I might not be able to from this exact spot, but I think we can get across, because we've done that level, which means the only thing waiting for us is this boss fight area up here. Oh man, this is intense. But before we hop into that, I definitely need to search around this whole section and see if we can't find any kind of bonus thing. Small Fry, are you looking around? Sure hope you are. Huh. I'm not quite seeing too much. What about this stuff? No. It's gotta be around here somewhere though, right buddy? It could have been way down there, but I, I don't think so. I feel like we searched down there pretty thoroughly. All right, well it must be down here somewhere then. I'll try to throw a small fry around and see if they find anything, but I don't know, this is a little bit concerning. Cause it's gotta be somewhere nearby. You can see we're actually out of the zone for it there. 
So that's what I'm trying to look for. It can't be any farther out than right here for this section. So maybe it's, I don't know, somewhere entirely different. Okay, so I looked all over for it and I really couldn't find anything. Small fry is sometimes really picky with when it comes to like getting alerts about what's around. Sometimes they just don't bother. Either way, we're not gonna worry about it too much for right now. Maybe something will pop up after we complete this boss fight, which is gonna be the obscurest Kyroscurist, whatever that means. Fight your way to the exit, let's go. All right, so here we are, unauthorized personnel prohibited beyond this point. Oh man, so we can only use our hero gear here. This seems pretty intense though. So we fought the first two members of Deep Cut. Will this be the third? Hmm, hmm. Our captain is picking up a strong signal. It might be ex-Captain Cuttlefish. Uh-oh, it's Big Man. Hey, hold it right there. Hi. I'm holding it. Hey, this treasure isn't yours, you can't have it. Hey, I wouldn't th fight you if I didn't have to, but this is for Splatsville. Oh no. Whoa, he's green. Whoa, whoa, the hype mantis from Big Man, this is just like Mario Sunshine. Whoa, check out my sweeps. This is just like Mario Sunshine. We just played this game earlier this year. This is so cool, the shadow is splitting up. It is even the same like color of ink as Mario Sunshine. What a cool reference. Can you guess which one is the real me? I don't have to, I'm just gonna splat all of them. Maybe Small Fry can do something or not, okay. Oh, I found you, I found you. Oh, that's his actual body. We got him. This is so cool, what a reference. Hey, you're pretty good. But I won't lose. Hey, I've been training too hard to lose. Oh no, going back at it, huh? So here we go again with this. So far this seems like the simplest boss fight. Come on, come on. Watch me sling through this ink. All right, so if we really want to, we can go pretty crazy with it and hit a couple of them like that. But there's still quite a lot of these around. I need to be careful my ink tank as well. Oh, they're sneaking behind me. Maybe that one? No, 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 okay. Geez, there's actually a lot going on here. Whoa, behind me, behind me, ah! This is gonna be some way to stop the octopods. This is crazy, wow! That was actually ridiculous. I couldn't tell what was going on. You'll get sniped if you stand still. Focus on inking the ground so you can keep moving. I would love to. Um, instead of that, yeah, let's do this. And then toss that over. Come on. So this might be harder than I thought it would be. I got that one. I gotta fill up on ink again. And while we're doing that, we need to move. Oh, did we find you? I don't know. What, his shadow exploded? That's pretty crazy, isn't it? Okay, there's another one over this way. Is that it? No, 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 behind me. Ah! Somebody to stop the octopod from popping out of the shadows. I don't know how, uh, but I'm just gonna try to fill up what I can because I am super low on ink. They are chasing me down. Oh, there you are. He's out again. Get him, Agent 3. That's it, keep it up. This is wild. Hey, you've got the moves, it's true. But I've got uh, more moves. No more kid gloves, it's big man time. All right, big man. This one's for all the marbles. Who's gonna win? Okay, let's give this a try. Oh, there's some platforms, no hard feelings when you lose, okay? At least big man's nice about it. I do appreciate that. Some of the other characters were a little bit mean, but big man's so charming. Okay, so I need to, ooh, I, I gotta stop mismanaging my ink because this happens and then I'm in big trouble. So I think we back up a little bit. And if I get into a bind like that again, I got a super slam, like that. But I think whenever we see some big ones coming right towards us, we need to, whoa, back it up and just sort of make the most of what we got. Come on, they are right behind me. I don't like it. When I throw one of those bombs, that's when I really need to refill because they use up a lot. Turn them back around now. Cause they're just right on our tail the whole time. Oh no. I got that pretty well. And this is a great place to slam. Got it? Maybe it wasn't, I don't know. Second thoughts are coming in. Ooh, wait, that's not too bad. But none of these are the real big man. Come on, where, where's he at? 
That's not him. Oh, there's another one. Oh gosh, don't push me off, don't push me off. Whoa. Don't you dare. This has to be him. Here he is, he's out again, let him have it. There we go. The cats is cheering you on. Well, thank you. I think we got big man. Hey, oof. Well, that was a flop. I really tried to. Oh, poor big man. Hey, hey, hey. What is that? Uh, whoa. Did he just explode? <laughs> Goodbye, big man. It was nice meeting you. <laughs> okay, I guess we won. And look at this, we get another piece of the treasure too. What is this one gonna be? I have no clue, but it looks wild. Well, it's not Gramps, but we should probably grab this thing anyway since we fought for it. It looks like an engine of some sort. The Obscurus Chiroscurus completed. That was a wild fight. Uh-huh, uh-huh. The captain says you crushed it, Agent 3. And they also had some choice things to say about Deep Cut. Wouldn't want to be them right now. It me. Come in, do you copy? Gramps, we, we read you. Not uh exactly loud and clear, but we read you. What's up? Are you okay? What's happening? Where are you? Or where you are? Ha, ah, I finally got this dad blasted thing to work get working again. Okay, so here's my report. I'm being held captive by something or someone or something called calling themselves Mr. Grizz. I heard that loud and clear. So did I. As for where I am, beats me. But my left knee is aching something fierce which means I'm at altitude, somewhere high up. Well, that's a pretty good hint. There's only one place that fits the bill, right? Well, well, your injured knee may have betrayed this location, but don't expect any workers comp. Thank you for this, by the way. I won't underestimate the legendary leader of the Squid Big Splatoon again. I'll just go ahead and deal with you now before you become an actual inconvenience. Wait a minute, hey, what's that? What do you think you're doing? Gah! Oh no, Captain Cuttlefish is in trouble. Huh, that didn't sound great for Gramps. Gramps, we're coming for you, stay strong. Oh no, so way up there, just as soon as we figure out how to get wherever you are. Do you think somewhat, some of this stuff we collected might come in handy? Agent three, why don't you go take a closer look at it? It might be our, just our ticket into that rocket. So, it looks like there's something we do here to go and save Gramps, but I think this is something we'll wanna save for the next episode, for sure. If we take a look at everything else, so if we go back to Site 6, there is still one more thing left to do there that I haven't figured out, right? Um, maybe? No, it looks like it's cleared out now, so maybe we're good, you'll get all the check marks. So maybe it was just that I hadn't found that level? I guess so. So as you can see, we have all the check marks there, but this one, this one's a surveyed. I don't know, oh. Why does that one say surveyed, but the rest don't? I'm not quite sure. Oh, that's interesting. Um, maybe because I got all the gray spots gone, because like that one still has a few, this one still has a few, but this one definitely doesn't. It doesn't say surveyed, so I don't know what that means. We'll have to keep an eye out for that. If anybody knows, feel free to let me know. But we have enough points to get our final upgrade here. The small fry damage up increases damage dealt by small fry. We can unlock it for five, and then we can buy it for 10, and then we'll be totally zeroed out on both points. So there we go, boom, we are fully upgraded. And you can see the entire design makes a little fish. Pretty cool. Um, so yeah, if we look at the kettles, we got level one through 12 done and the boss fight against Big Man. And then for the archive, we still have one last eternal log to read through log 006. The beings that had emerged from the water soon emerged from the cavern of Alterna itself. From there, they flourished quickly. It wasn't long before they had explored every corner of the world. This apocal event gave great significance to the crater above Alterna and its surrounding territories, now referred to as the Splatlands. The region would, from that point on, be known as the land of fresh beginnings, among the creatures that now thrive on the surface. These newly evolved beings, having scattered themselves across the globe, soon gave rise to the distinct cultures and unique ways of life. Out of all the species now roaming the earth, squid and octopuses soon distinguished themselves via intelligence and fresh vibes, so to speak. It wasn't long before they became the apex species of the planet. Now, I must fast forward a bit. 5,000 years later, a peculiar individual was born. This squid quickly rose to fame in the Splatlands due to some 
unique characteristics. Yes, this individual was embraced as a prophet, gifted with numerous revelations that they shared among their fellow squids. It was another turning point for squid kind. During this period, the foundations for modern cephalopod civilization were laid. That individual squid is now widely known and celebrated as the prog progenitor? Yeah, progenitor of the modern day inkling. Who could that be? Do we know that character? The land of fresh beginnings, that is crazy information. Okay then, so lots of squid inkling information there, but we did really good. As far as I could tell, we are all finished up with all the different areas for now, and we can move on to what might be the final battle of the game in the next episode of Splatoon 3. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.